Every year at Shorewood High School, hundreds of students get their yearbooks and flip through the pages to reminisce about the year that was. But this year, one image of a female student didn't sit well with some. It got posted all over Twitter and it sparked a huge, enormous argument. There have been pretty mean comments. Some people have been telling her to actually like go kill herself. And the picture shows a white student with heavy makeup on, which some are labeling black facing. I know she didn't mean to be offensive. She didn't mean black face like in an offensive way. She just meant it like she had a bad, a bad tan. I think this looks just like a really, really bad tan. She went to a tanning salon. Those who know the student and have spoken to her about it say she never meant to offend anyone. She was just Snapchatting back and forth with her friends with a whole bunch of Claire's bronzer on. It wasn't meant to be offensive. The girl who put bronzer on her face isn't racist has never said any racist remarks, nice, sweet person. Other students say while they believe the student isn't racist and did not have bad intentions, the picture still sends the wrong message. Just because it may not be offensive to you, it's still may be offensive to other minority groups. It's clearly hurtful. The school district says the picture should not have been included in the yearbook, and they're planning to send an apology to students and parents. We apologize. It should not have been, that image should not have been included in the Shorewood High School yearbook. Now for the yearbooks that haven't been handed out yet, the school district plans to replace that photo with a sticker with a different photo on it. And for all people offended who already have their yearbooks, they're invited to bring them back and get that sticker put on in place of that photo as well.